Hello Scale Modelers from YouTube and welcome to my channel. This is my introduction video for the small scale group build announced by Brian at BG's Model Workshop as well as by Sean at the Scale Model Car Guy channel. Many thanks to both of you for hosting this great idea. The group build is starting on February 1st and running to February 28th. So, I would like to show you the model kit that I will build for this group build and the unboxing of it. The model kit reproduces this 1928 Rolls-Royce Phantom 1, and as indicated in the box, it's a Revell Classics line, limited edition of 5,000 pieces. The Revell Classics line is a limited reissue of select model kits from the 1950s, 60s, or 70s. This is a reissue from 2009 by Revell Germany, and is an historical model produced using the Matchbox original mold that was manufactured more than 30 or 40 years ago. The kit reference number is 00014, in 132nd scale, with 159mm length after assembly, and it is defined as a skill level 4, for kits with up to 150 parts for more experienced modelers. The kit comes in a rigid box with opening from the top. The car pieces are molded in red for the body parts and brown for interior and for some of the parts of the engine, transmission, and suspension. In black for the chassis, fenders, rooftop, and spoked rims. There are several chrome parts like front lights, window frames, and the radiator. For the windows and light lenses, we have clear plastic. The four tires and the two spare tires are in hard black rubber. Inside the box there are also the instructions manual and a decal sheet. In my kit the decal sheet is missing, but as far as I could check in the instructions, the decals are only the license plates, so I will print new ones. The pictorial, multi-language manual sheet includes the historical description of the Rolls-Royce Phantom 1, and some warnings before start building the model kit. Then we have the indication of the used symbols in this manual, as well as the used colors to paint the model kit. There is an overview of kit part sprues, and then the construction manual is divided into 18 steps. Painting instructions for details are indicated during assembly. I don't know yet if I will do any update video during the build of this kit, or if I will do only a final video with the complete build. We'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching, and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below with any question or feedback. See you in the next video.